Hey yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video on my channel. So today for you guys, I have quite a, quite a game for you guys today. I have a game called <laughs> This game looks very scary compared to any of the other games that I've played before. For some reason, I've just not played the scarier ones. But today I'm gonna play a scarier one. And uh, it's gonna be interesting. And we're gonna go through it together. And it's gonna be amazing. And um, link is in the description. Let's go sh get straight into it. Um, Evelyn Harper committed suicide on Friday, 22nd, July 2005. That's really great. Here's a description of the game. Intrigued by the puzzling last words of your late grandmother, along with the acquired key to apartment 66, you set out to explore the Oakwood residences to uncover your grandmother's cryptic secrets. Soon you realize you are in over your head. She killed her daughter. We're being introduced to a lot of good stuff right off the bat. Last night, my grandma passed away. She gave me a key and said her last words. Oakwood residence. Residences. Room 66. It's for Evelyn. Wow. Here we are. All right, so May 19th, 2007, I was... I don't know, maybe five or four or five, something like that. Anyway, we're looking for room at 66, so of course it's 66. Do I got a flashlight or anything like that? Evelyn's apartment is upstairs. Okay. All right, guys, what do you think of the gameplay? I mean, it's pretty smooth. I got a good computer, can run it. So that's good. What about this door? Can we try this door? Wrong apartment. Okay, I'm sorry for just trying to open your apartment. Look at this place, though. We got like the Outlast type of camera view. All right, we're looking for apartment 66 and we're gonna try to find the discoveries of our grandma's last words. Okay, 63, of course, we're at the very tippy top, aren't we? What's gonna happen? All right, we're at 65, 64, so 66 should be on this floor. No way. <laughs> of course, why does it look like this? This must be Evelyn's apartment. Alright, I hear crying right off the bat, so I'm terribly sorry. Utility closet, that's awesome. Oh my goodness gracious. I'm just going to turn my volume down a tad. I know I should be wearing headphones, but I'm not at that stage of making YouTube videos yet. Okay, so the... Um, Light switches don't work, and the lights shut off, but at least we know we're by the front door because we see light switches. Oh no, I'm just supposed to hit E on my freaking... Okay, never mind. Alright, so we're in the apartment. Nothing too crazy. We got mold on the fridge, so that's awesome. What do we got in here, though? Oh, we are actually kind of stocked up. Okay, nothing that I can interact with. All right, how about in the fridge? Nothing too much, okay. Is this a, a washer or a dryer? In, is this a something in the kitchen? All right, so nothing too crazy, except for that right there. We got some handprints on the door right there. Probably gonna learn about that in a few. Turn on this light here. All right. So nothing too crazy. Got that old-fashioned wallpaper. Got a lot of bottles here, so don't know if we're dealing with some sort of like alcoholism or perhaps TV doesn't work. Probably for the best. All right, let's go ahead and check out these doors. Sweetie, your keys in the kitchen drawer. All right, let's go ahead and try that. All right, kitchen drawer, kitchen drawer. The plank is screwed on. Oh, okay. So we're probably going to have to find something else for that later. But let's... Are we going to question this? Locked. Okay. Well, we'll probably figure it out in a minute. I need to check the kitchen drawers. I just did. So let's go ahead and open that. Okay. We got a lot of blood on the walls. Great epic start. Oh, we got a flashlight. My body lies in hell. Okay. Anything at the window? Oh god. Oh god, god that scares me so much. Alright, let's uh let's get out of here, I think. 
That door is still locked. Okay, so I got a flashlight now, which I can use with F. Really cool. Let's see what's going on here. Is this one... Still locked. Oh, God. Power went out. Flashlight time. Press F for flashlight. Got you on that. <clears throat> okay, I really don't know what I'm doing. I'm supposed to be finding maybe something. Shoot. Turn that off. I don't want that on. Oh, but thanks for opening the door for me. Now I can explore. Memento Mori. Un is honest. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I do have some of their merch, though. Bin won't open. Okay, it looks like we got a tub full of blood. It's really cool. Kind of looks like paper, almost. See what I mean? It's kind of like a paper texture. Um, oh, do I have to collect all these? Okay, cool. Pretty simple. I hate turning around. Obviously, I'm just expecting to see someone there. Oh, great. So this door is just completely ripped off its hinges, but this door is cracked open. <gasps> God dang, that actually... Wow, I've never been scared like that before in a horror game. This is why I don't play these ones, because they get me really good. But I don't realize that it's just for a second, and then it's over. Demo completed. I hope you enjoyed the full game. will be released on Steam soon. That's it, really? Do I gotta walk back or nothing, or do I just quit from here? Um, okay. Surely there's gotta be something else. I'm still in the game. God, get out of here, dude. Seriously? I mean, that scare got me really good, not gonna lie. Alright, you guys, so I've looked everywhere. I've looked for more drawers. I've looked for anything else to open or interact with, and nothing. Nothing's happening, and there's no bins to open or anything like that. So I guess that really is the end of the demo. I guess in that case, thank you guys for watching. If you want to play this game for yourself, there's a full release coming soon on Steam, as it said at the very end. So link is in the description to the one that is on itch. And um, I got more games lined up. So take care and peace out.